What's up guys, Lightning Eagle 14 here, soaring back into everyday life with another video. In this video we're going to be talking about my Drain Blaster Absolver Shotgun Loadout that I've recently finished compiling the gear for. I'm going to have to keep this video short because the mosquitoes are everywhere and they're really getting on my nerves and I think if I stay out here much longer I'm going to lose my mind. So, keeping this video as short as possible. Anyways, so in this video we will be covering um, the gear that I'm carrying for this loadout, the sort of mindset or play style or reasons why I chose the gear for this loadout that I did and how I would play this loadout and we're also going to be covering how many darts and uh, other things of that nature. So diving right on into it, um, starting off with the play style behind this loadout. This loadout is meant to be very fast, very light sort of run and gun loadout. Uh, because of the fact that the Drain Blaster doesn't get very much range, it gets around 35-40 feet uh, with one of these absolvers, so you really have to get up pretty close to someone to actually hit them. So that's why I have the shield mainly, so I can get in close and protect myself uh, from people shooting at me when, I, when I'm rushing in. And also to give me cover while I'm reloading this thing because if you hadn't figured it out already, the reload on a Drain Blaster is pretty darn slow uh, because you have to pump it up like 12 times, grab a new cylinder, switch it out, and then keep going from there. You can reload in about 12 seconds or so, but 12, 15 seconds, but uh, it's still pretty dang slow. So yeah, that's why I have the shield, is so I can get in close and uh, protect myself when I'm rushing someone. It's more of a hit and run type thing. Rush in, get someone, rush back, and get back to cover or to somewhere where I can cover myself better with the shield. So that's basically the play style or reasoning behind this loadout. Uh, moving on to the gear, obviously the main item of this loadout is the Drain Blaster. Uh, this is just my Drain Blaster that I bought off of eBay. It has a 3 4 inch PVC um, thing that I glued onto the front to allow it to take the various rifle absolvers or um, absolvers and things that I have for it. I have several videos on this. Uh, I can link them in the description if anyone is interested. But uh, yeah, that's basically the Drain Blaster. Other main thing is this shield. Uh, this is just a slide, if you couldn't tell already. It's just a sled that I picked up a while ago. Works pretty well as a shield. Covers about half of me or two thirds, which is uh, perfectly fine. And honestly, if your rules allow you to have shields bigger than that, then there's probably a problem and yeah so uh, moving on to the other gear and things obviously I have the absolvers and for that I just have these um, Maverick uh, Maverick and Strongarm Cylinder Absolvers and uh, these are just the turret from a Strongarm or Maverick hot glued onto a 3 fourths to I want to say one and a half inch PVC reducer I'll have the correct info up on screen if that is not correct. But yeah, I have five of these. Then when I'm done with those, I switch to these, which are my uh, rifle absolvers. And these hold five rifle, absol five rifle rounds uh, in this tube. It's what I'm calling an inline absolver. It's basically a piece of uh, one inch CPVC glued to a piece of half inch PVC. And then that just fits onto this three fourths to half inch PVC reducer which fits on the drain blaster and that works like that so yeah um, to carry all of these absolvers I have for the dart absolvers I have what uh, is my my end strike bandolier thing that Hasbro makes um, I got this a really long time ago when I was like probably 12 maybe so several several years ago at this point and uh, it works really well for these uh, for these cylinders. It doesn't work so well for clips, which is what it was designed for. For these, it works really well. Holds them very securely. I can jump, run. They aren't going anywhere. And then to hold the rifle absolvers, uh, I just made this dump pouch, which is kind of ghetto, but it's a um, it's a drawstring backpack that I have. Uh, folded into a into basically a circle or into a size that will fit all seven of my rifle absolvers and then that uh, is just duct taped together and then I duct taped on a cardboard strap or a cardboard belt loop to uh, so it can fit on my belt and that's very secure as well it's not really going anywhere either 
So yeah, that's um, all of the gear in total for ammunition. I'm carrying uh, 65 projectiles, uh, 30 of which are darts and 35 of which are uh, rifle rounds. Each of my rifle absolvers hold five rounds each and I have seven of those and then I have five of the dart absolvers and those hold six each. So in total 65 rounds which is probably enough to last you through a round or so but um, you obviously wouldn't want to run this for a longer game you'd need a lot more than just the 12 shots that I have but considering that it has such a slow reload and a slow rate of fire uh, 12 shots is definitely plenty for a round or so so yeah I think that's everything that I need to cover for this video uh, all of the gear and equipment and blasters and other things which there really isn't a whole lot of as it being such a light and fast loadout. So I think that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed, please comment, like, and subscribe. I really would appreciate it. And uh, leave any, any comments, suggestions, concerns, questions, please leave those in the comments section down below. Uh, that's going to do it for this video. I'm Lightning Eagle 14. This is my loadout, and I'll see you guys in the next video.